us a little bit more because this is a very colorful guy, Lincoln Chafee. Well, Lincoln Chafee is colorful indeed. You guys noted that he was once a Republican and now is a Democrat. In between being a Republican and a Democrat, he was an independent. So he's covered the waterfront in terms of party affiliation. He's also served at every level of government. He was a mayor of Warwick, Rhode Island for, for many, for four, year, four terms, then was a U.S. senator, then was the governor of Rhode Island. He won the governorship in a multi-candidate race where he only had about 35 percent of the vote. His performance in office as governor was poor enough that he couldn't really run for re-election. He decided not to run because his approval rating was so low. So he's not had a glorious career, and, and it's the kind of career that makes some people wonder why on earth he's running for president. It seems like he's running really just to make a point, which is that Hillary Clinton can't be trusted, and America needs to uh, not be nearly so adventurous in terms of world affairs. Those are the two big points he wants to make. Uh, we'll see how that goes for him. Uh, but uh, the, the, the idea that he will be the Democratic nominee, not taken very seriously by very many uh, people in the Democratic Party. That's going to be a lot of work to just uh, make a point. Uh, John, there was a new Iowa poll out on Bloomberg.com slash politics uh, to the question of will George W.'s influence be a good or bad thing if his brother gets elected uh, and has to run for the presidency? The majority of pollers said it would actually be a good thing. I saw that and I was surprised. Uh, what was your reaction? Well, that's, this is the latest installment of our Bloomberg Politics Des Moines Register Iowa poll. It's kind of the gold standard poll for Iowa. We've been rolling it out all week. It's a, I think for a lot of people it will be a little surprising. I think, you know, a lot of people get a little confused about what Jeb Bush is, what the real George W. Bush problem is for Jeb Bush. And, and we asked the question whether people would mind if he was the advisor among Iowa Republicans. As you said, they don't really mind him as the advisor. Uh, to Jeb Bush. The question is whether they want another Bush in the White House. And when we went out and talked to Iowans at our focus group a couple weeks ago, what they were worried about is that the Bush name will make Jeb Bush unelectable because George W. Bush is not very popular with the broader electorate. So it's a, you got to parse it a little bit to understand. It's not that, 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 that all Republicans don't like George W. Bush. That's not the issue. The issue is that a lot of Republicans worry that George W. Bush as an overhang will keep Jeb Bush out of the White House.